So this is bringing untold hardships to many people. It's causing problems, health problems, and the health ministry is fully aware of this, and they're, they're mobilized to address this situation. And if anyone is affected health-wise by the smoke inhalation and all of these other issues associated with these fires, they should seek medical attention or get in touch with the ministry immediately. Secondly, it is affecting the livelihoods of some communities where the drought has killed the crops in some of the arid parts of our country. Um, even on the coastal belt, we have had many communities that have asked us for water, irrigation water. The extreme weather that we will continue to experience, that is why we are spending so much of our resources and adaptation measures. You know that the entire sum of money that we are going to raise from the sale of forest carbon, um, maybe over $2 billion US dollars will be spent from uh, in, the, in the country on adaptation outside of the part that goes directly to the Amerindian villages. And that is to manage water resources. In periods when we have excess water, to get rid of it so they don't cause flooding, and then to make accommodation, like more reservoirs, etc., for the prolonged drought season. 